Welcome to the final ladies gift guide. This is the third in the gift guide series for ladies. Today is going to be the under $25 gift recommendations. Don't forget that I already have two other ladies gift guides out. The first one is the luxury gift guide. That is the gift recommendations that are over the $50 price point. The second video is the $25 to $50 gift recommendations. Those videos will be linked in the corresponding blog post to this video. You will want to check those out. There are also a couple men's gift guides included in that blog post. One is the every man's gift guide and the other one is the golf edition gift guide for the golf lovers in your life. I also have a tech gift guide video for the tech lovers in your life. Also, let me remind you that if you click on the show more right below this video, you will see the very top link. You can click on that link and that will take you to the corresponding blog post. You will want to go there to shop for everything that I am talking about. I will also be including items that fall in the $25 to $50 price point that I don't show you in this video, but are also wonderful gift recommendations. Without further ado, let's dive in and we are going to do just like we did in the past two ladies gift guides. We are going to start with the beauty items. The first beauty goodie I want to talk about is the little ornament that comes with a mini mascara. This is the Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara. This is a very popular mascara. I love these little affordable gifts. These are wonderful for secret Santas. So if you do a secret Santa at work or if you need a stocking stuffer, or these would also make a lovely little gift to put on top of another package. This will run you $12. Another great gift, and a lot of ladies could use an updated and new eyelash curler. This is by Tarte. This is the Tarte Tardius Mascara, and then they have a beautiful eyelash curler. Tarte comes out with this every single year. It is $20. I have picked one of these up in the past. They always do some type of decor, and Tarte eyelash curlers are wonderful eyelash curlers. I know I have really enjoyed mine. Up next on the beauty agenda is the Urban Decay 24-7 Troublemaker Mascara and Eye Pencil Duo. This is a cute little kit right here. I don't want to take the packaging off because this is a gift, but there's a little seal there and you can see the UD, which stands for Urban Decay. But this is also just a nice little set. I do think this pouch could be recycled for something. I, I'll be honest with you, ladies, if you're watching, uh, when I first saw this, I thought this is great to put like a few tampons in and a couple pads in. So I'm always thinking of how can you recycle packaging that a lot of these holiday gift sets come in. But this would make a wonderful gift for somebody who really enjoys to have mascara and eyeliner and something that they repetitively go through. This is going to cost you $28. Loving this little kit by NARS. This is $24. This is by your Man Ray collection. There are different ones to pick out from. This is called the Love Triangle. This has your blood and an audacious lipstick. This was my favorite one because I don't know if you are familiar with the cult following Anna by NARS, but this little triangle kit here has the lipstick Anna in it and then it also has the blush called Impassioned. So these are beautiful shades. These are actually shades that look beautiful on me. They are going to be more of your travel size minis, which I think are perfect for carrying on the go or for traveling. Another great gift for a stocking or to put on top of a package or to give as a secret Santa gift is some blotting sheets. I love the Bosha blotting sheets. These come in different packaging. They will run you $7. Moving into lips, and if you recall, in the $25 to $50 price range gift guide, I had talked about the give me some nude lip in the Sephora favorites and I had mentioned I was waiting for the give me some bold lips in the Sephora favorites well that did arrive this would actually fall in the 25 to 50 dollar price point video as it is 28 dollars but again I didn't have it in time so I wanted to share it with you today it will be linked in both of the videos sticking with the lip theme I am all about the Stila play it cool stay all day liquid lipstick set it has three different shades in there I have actually broken into this kit so it is obviously mine I've wore the lightest shade in the middle shade in fact I believe in my last video I was wearing this shade and I probably linked it I'm really loving this I'm loving the staying power this lasted me through a ladies event that I just recently did and that sometimes is what you need especially if you are drinking a lot of drinks so I think this is a great kit there is a warm kit and a cool kit so if you have more warm undertones you would probably want to get the warm kit 
I have more cool undertones, so this is perfect for me. This is going to be $20 perfect little purse size. I think it's wonderful to make a great stocking stuffer. And again, if you wanted to move up into the higher price point for a hostess gift or a secret Santa, this would make a lovely gift. Also in the $20 price range, we have a Kat Von D Everlasting Liquid Lipstick. This is also going to be that same type of formula. This was actually a request by one of my daughters for Christmas. So this is the shade that she had picked out. It is actually called Bow and Arrow, and this is $20. If you have a false eye lash lover in your life, I do think getting a little set of different false eyelashes is kind of a wild card gift, maybe something they wouldn't expect. You could actually put a little lash glue with it and it would make a lovely gift. This actually should have fallen in the $25 to $50 price point gift guide because it is $48, but I still wanted to share it with you. You could also get smaller sets. You can find a lot of these on Amazon. I will have some varieties linked below. I know myself, I really enjoy false lashes and if somebody were to get me some that maybe I had not tried, I would love it. Along with the false eyelash theme. This was a little gift that was given to me last year for Christmas by a friend and it is actually <laughs> false eyelash holder. It will hold three of your false lashes and if you're a false lash wearer you know that you can wear your lashes over and over again. This also comes in a couple different colors. I think a beautiful very affordable gift for your lash lover would be to get them this little thing maybe one set of false lashes and some glue and maybe throw in a mascara depending on what your price point is. Sometimes I think it's fun and very unique and very personalized to put a bunch of little things together in one bag or in one box or in one basket, but they all kind of go together. So I think that would make a great gift and there's a wonderful gift suggestion for you. Going into lip care, I always love the EOS and I'm sure many of you are very familiar with the EOS. This is the Holiday Collection Limited Edition three pack. A lot of times what I will do is I will decide what three daughters get this and I will do a group gift. I love to do group gifts. I've talked about it in the other gift guides that I've done and I will let them select which one they want for them but this is such a great kit $8.99 also a wild card gift something that people may not think of is to do a lip scrub this is my favorite one it's called albeit I love the packaging I actually leave this setting out on a little tray because the packaging is so beautiful going along just the pretty line I love this lip balm by Emily Corden again loving the packaging love the little box that it came in it actually works amazing I put this on a lot of times right before I go to bed or if I'm just working from home and not doing my makeup that day I have to admit I am kind of a sucker for packaging because I like to leave these sitting out I just think they're very pretty hitting on skincare I shared in my last video that I have a love for mask and this is a kit that I pick up every single year again it is the Sephora favorites it's $22 this is the beauty on mask what I love about the Sephora favorites boxes and kits is that you get a variety of the items that they carry in their store. They are not necessarily Sephora brand. I think there's only one thing in this box that is actually Sephora and it is a sheet mask. What happens is you get a variety of the different skincare lines that they carry. So it gives you the opportunity to try different products out from different brands in smaller sizes. They're generally a little bit bigger than a sample size. And then the beautiful thing is if you like it, you can go purchase it in the larger size. So I've always loved this and I always keep notes of the masks that I like year after year so that if I do want to pick up one in the full size, I can. I also think eye masks are wonderful. This is one of my favorite. It is the V2 Code Oxygen Eye Mask. I think they're wonderful for your skincare junkie. Shiseido also has a wonderful one. These are probably my two favorite eye masks because number one, they stay on and they don't move and they don't irritate you while they're on. Moving into hair, but not compromising the Sephora favorites, we have the Sephora favorites Textured Waves, $24. Loving this kit. It just gives you a whole bunch of hair products 
that maybe have to do with more texture and more wave in your hair. Love this, pick this up for a gift. Again, same concept. You're going to get a little bit smaller size to test out and then if you like it, it gives you the opportunity to go pick it up in the full size. Super loving this little set by Batiste. This is tis the season for gorgeous hair and who doesn't want some gorgeous hair, ladies? This is a dry shampoo trio, same type of concept. This has blush, original, and tropical, so I'm assuming we have a couple different scents. I don't know if they are going to work any differently, but if they did, it would give you an idea of which one you liked so you would know which one you would want to pick up in the full size. And this is only $9.99. Again, Secret Santa gift makes a lovely gift topper and also great in the stocking. Already mentioned, I am a sucker for the ornaments just like the Better Than Sex mascara that I had shared. This is $10. It's the pickup dry shampoo in a great purse size. I like to carry products like this in my purse or on the go or for travel, but I love the color scheme with this one. So it kind of sucked me in because sometimes that does happen. I am a female and packaging can suck me in. It did with this one. So this will make a great gift again. You can put it on top of a gift. You get me, you know where I'm going with this and it'll also make a great stocking stuffer and the secret Santa gift at work. There you go. You know my love for L'Occitane. This is my favorite soap. This is the bar soap that I use. It is only $5. So there you go, secret Santa and stocking. Love this. It's part of the almond line that I talked about in my past two videos. Although it's small, it lasts forever and I love it. It has a little bit of an exfoliation type texture to it. But what I do is I mix this in with my L'Occitane shower gel. That's my shower cocktail. It is awesome, I love it. It's effervescence at its finest. Also from L'Occitane, I can't be without my favorite hand cream. I always use the same one, same thing. Almond line, it's the best. I have one in my car, I have one in my handbag, I have one next to my bed, I have one in my bathroom, I have one everywhere, and I'm going to continue, it is the best. Another great stocking stuffer gift, another great secret Santa gift, and it makes a great hostess gift. This hand cream is $12, but you can also get them in gift sets and I will link them. The only thing with the gift sets is you're going to get a variety, but sometimes that can be nice because you can split them up or you can find out which fragrance you like the best. They're all familiar with Bath and Body Works. Everybody has shopped there forever and will continue. Believe it or not, my favorite soap that is carried at Bath and Body Works is not the ones that you would think. My favorite is the C.O. Bigelow. Not only do I love the packaging, I love the fragrance. This one is Cashmere Fig, one of my favorite scents, $12. I know, I know my girls do, and I love it too. I've never used one because I don't have a bathtub, but, and I don't have time to take a bath or don't make the time to take a bath, but uh, I know my girls love Lush, and I think women of all ages, again, these are just great secret Santa gifts, great stocking stuffer gifts. We are always a sucker for the bath bombs and the bubble bars. This is a bubble bar. It is called Plum Snow. It is $12.95. Oh, it smells amazing. This one here is a bath bomb. It is $5.95 and it is called Sherbert Dip. Both of these are part of their Christmas collection. They do come out with special ones during the holidays. Loving this one here. This is a bath bomb, $7.95 and this one is called Christmas Sweater. I love that. That's such a great name and look at that. It looks like a Christmas sweater. This one here is a bubble bar. It is called Christmas Eve. Smells amazing. The difference between the bath bombs and the bubble bars is the bubble bars have more of like an oil to them. So I believe your texture in your bath, maybe it's going to be a little bit more moisturizing, but if you go to the website, you'll be able to find all the differences to those. This one here is $7.95 again, Christmas Eve. How perfect. This is also a bubble bar and how sweet is the snowman? He is $7.95. Last but not least, and this is new to the Lush line, this is a bubble bar. It is called the Bubble Spinner, and how fun and festive is this being a little fidget spinner. You can always pick up one of their catalogs and you can read about their different products and all the different varieties and fun and festive little bubble bars and bath bombs and everything else that Lush has. It makes a great gift for the younger girls in your life, the teenagers, even early 20s, a lot of them would love something like this. Really loving this next gift, and I think it makes a great gift idea for, let's say, a teacher, male lady, 
somebody from work, anything like that. I love this little bar soap right here. It is vanilla latte. And what is not to love about the red cup that is kind of a knockoff version of the Starbucks cup? It also has a two, so you can put the person's name there. But to go with it, I thought how appropriate to get a Starbucks gift card. You can put your to and from on there. The Starbucks is on the back. And check out that gift card right there. Is this just not like the perfect little themed gift? I love it. It is something I came up with. That's what you've got to do. You've got to think, what can I do to be a little bit creative, a little bit special? Anybody who loves their Starbucks is going to love a $15 Starbucks card. And then to add this in with it, perfect gift. Let's move into candles. You know all about my love for the Nest candle, Birchwood Pine to be exact, as I talked about it in every single video. I love this little votive. Again, it's a little ornament. It would make a great secret Santa or a stocking stuffer. It's got the votive inside there. This is going to be $16. Everyone is familiar with the Bath and Body Works candle. This is Winter Candy Apple. This is one of my daughter's favorite scents. You can get these at varying prices. I believe they are $22.50, but a lot of times they will run a special for about $12.50. So always watch and pick them up when you can get a two for special or when they do a discount. I, I don't think we have ever paid the full price for one of these. So I think it's a perfect gift right in a good price point. Another little catchy gift that somebody wouldn't think of is a room spray. They always have pretty ones at Pier 1 or different places like that. They also have them at Bath and Body Works. This is only $6, so again, if you have a secret Santa and you're giving several gifts out because those can add up and you want to try to keep them at a low price point, something like this would be great to fall into that price range. Target also has some very fun and festive, unique candles that can be something that is recycled. I picked this candle up, it smells amazing, but when it burns down, I think it makes a really nice bowl to put some candy in or to put some dip in or something like that. It also would look lovely in a bathroom with some soaps in it. If you follow me on Snapchat, you are well aware of my favorite coffee mug from Anthropology. This is $8, I believe. I will have it linked. I have one, my husband has one. Sometimes I drink out of his, but I do think that a personalized coffee mug or any type of glassware with their initial on it makes a lovely gift. I love this one as well. A lot of times I just set them out for decor and put something in them. I also have this one that was gifted to me. I'm sure this is something you could find on Etsy. I'll have some varieties linked. This one here says blogging day. I love it. I also have this one that says sleep period, blog period, repeat period. Yes, that pretty much sums it up. Starbucks also comes out with their whole holiday collection every single year. I'm not sure if this falls into the under $25 price point. I will have them linked, but they do always come out and a lot of them do sell out. So you'll want to pay attention to that. Starbucks also does the little ornament as well and always has the year on those. So you might have someone that collects those, or maybe they would be interested in collecting one of these little Starbucks cup ornaments every single year. Sticking with ornaments, I think ornaments make a lovely gift. I got my daughter one because she just recently purchased a new home of her own, my oldest daughter. So congratulations to her. And I got her an adorable ornament. She's already taken it with her, so I didn't get to share it with you. But I think doing a personalized ornament is a lovely gift. I have one here for my friend. You can get something like this under $20. And to me, this really says a lot when you are taking the time to personalize something. I know for me that just warms my heart. So that's another gift idea. And I will have the link to where I did this at in the blog post. I think doing a picture frame of maybe you and your girlfriend or a picture frame of you and one of your children or you and your spouse makes a lovely gift. Again, it's personalized. You took the time. I mean, how many of us actually have pictures laying around? Not many. So the fact that you took the time to send the photo over or print it out, put it in a frame, I think that is a beautiful gift and it's gonna fall right in the perfect price point of under $25. I talked about trinket trays and little gadgets like that in the last gift guide. Again, I still think they make a lovely gift. This is another item that you can always shop around at your local TJ Maxx. I believe that is where I picked this one up at, but I think they make great gifts as well. It's also a nice hostess gift. I also love this very, very heavy marble tray here. 
It's got the handles. You could use this in a bar area. You could use this in a bathroom on a vanity. There are lots of uses for this. I actually have it in my bedroom on my dresser and I keep all of my fragrance bottles on it. It is very, very pretty. This is only $24.99, but it is very heavy. It's just from Target. So this is an awesome gift. Stationery makes a lovely gift and you can also get stationery personalized. We've talked about planners and agendas in our previous videos. You can get them in this price point as well. I also talked about these little notebooks or journals in my last gift guide. The reason that I talked about these in that gift guide is because if you were doing a his and hers, you are going to get over the $25 price range. But if you were to pick up just one, this is only going to run you about $20. The beautiful thing about these particular ones that I picked up as a gift is you can pick out what type of paper you would like in the inside. You can have plain notebook paper, you can have lined, you can have the more graph or the chart look, which sometimes men prefer that type. So that is what I love about this. Not only can you make it personalized, you can also customize it however you want in the inside. If you have someone that really likes their floral prints and different prints like this, I've always loved the Rifle Paper Co. journals and notebooks. I have many of these. These are very great quality. They're there is something about the feel and the look of the outside that just impresses me so much and they always have a pretty inside as well. <laughs> we have three calendars here. I talked about these in last year's gift guide. I also have a video on the command center, the family calendar in our home. So I will be sure to link that in the blog post. You'll want to check that out. I pick up a new one of these every single year at this time. I also get my mother-in-law one and my mother as well. This year I got us all three the same one. You're gonna pay under $15 for something like this, but it's the perfect time of the year to give this as a gift. I know my mom and my mother-in-law look forward to receiving their calendar from us every single year. So it's a nice little tradition. Sticking with the calendar, this is the gift that was my favorite gift last year. It was gifted to me by my beautiful daughters. It is the calendar easel. This is from Shutterfly. This is going to cost you under $20. They may have a coupon code right now. I know that we just recently picked up some for gifts and got them at 40% off. You can pick so many different themes. This one is more of a floral print. It kind of reminds me of the Rifle Paper Co. look, but you can get whatever type of decor or taste your loved one has in their office or wherever they are going to put this. Again, this was my favorite gift last year and it is the only thing that I have asked for for this Christmas so far is another one of these. So just a little easel. These little cards, to me, this is a keepsake. The cards even have a very pretty background, under $20. You cannot go wrong. What a lovely gift. We actually made one of these for my mother-in-law this year because she travels during the winter and she can take something like this and enjoy it year round. Because we were just talking about Shutterfly, I wanna talk about the Shutterfly books. This is something we have done for years. Even my daughter just recently did one for a trip she took all on her own. These are the little books that you can upload photos to yourself and create your own book. What we do is every time we do a family trip of any sort, we will create a book as soon as we get home with all the pictures that we took on that trip. So it is a nice little keepsake. The other beautiful thing is the books come in all sorts of different sizes. So you can do even a smaller book. This is also a lovely gift for someone. My girls will go out and visit their grandparents maybe during the winter months while their grandparents are in Florida and they'll visit them for a few days and they will go and do a few different adventures with them. When they get home, they will create a little book just for their grandma and grandpa, and then they will send their grandparents a little thank you for letting them come and stay and they will send this book as the little thank you. So it will get shipped to them with a thank you card. I think it is such a great gift and it's very personalized. The other thing that my girls do when they do that is they also get one for themselves. So grandma and papa have the keepsake and then my daughter will have the keepsake as well. So it makes a lovely gift. That's a great suggestion for you. That is precious times with the grandparents and I love the fact that they wanna remember all the beautiful memories that they create with them. This is 
really a gift that I didn't know if I wanted to share, but one of my daughters asked for it, so why not share it? May give one of you an idea, especially if you have children that are moving out on their own, whether they're just getting married or they're engaged or they're just doing like my daughters. They're just they're flying the coop and, and we're loving it. <laughs> one of my daughters had asked for some spice jars and she also wanted a little labeler. So she requested this Dymo embossing label maker. What is really unique, I don't know if you can really see it, but it does the black label with the white lettering. So it's got that kind of modern look to it, and then she picked out these particular spice jars, so I bought 12 of them. She'll have her label maker, and then I actually got her some additional tape. So this is going to be a whole kit, a whole set. It'll all be linked. And then from Target, I picked up this really nice wood spice crate to put all of her 12 different spice jars in. So I just think this makes a really fun gift, something she asked for, and it could be a great gift idea for one of you. Cell phone cases make a wonderful gift if you know what type of phone they have. I love this one. Again, we're going personalized. My girls gifted this to me and it has pictures of my husband and I, the kids and I, just the kids, and I just adore it. I, I love anything personalized. When the kids take the time to do something like this, it just, it warms my heart. It really does. That There's nothing better than having something given to you that your kids put together just for you. I love this fun glittery one. This would be perfect for maybe somebody younger. It's only $12. I also love this marble one here. I love the color scheme and this is only $24.99 so it falls right under that $25 mark. Sticking with tech and I talked about these in the tech gift guide. I think these little sync chargers from Toddy Gear are a perfect little gift to put in their stocking. As you can tell we have five. We have five daughters. This is going to be perfect. I also talked in that video and shared in that video and did a giveaway in that video of the little pocket toddy. So again, if you want to see more of what these are, you can always go to that gift guide to see me give a little bit more of a demo of what these are exactly like. Another great little personalized gift, and you can do these on Etsy, is a little clip just like this that can go around their little charging cord. This one here was gifted to me and I love it. It has my name on it makes a perfect little stocking stuffer or again your secret Santa gift. Another great gift and something that a lot of people would not think of, throw pillows make a great gift. This is also a great time to purchase a seasonal pillow. Let's say for instance you are going to be celebrating Christmas early. The beginning of December you might have a Christmas party. How nice would it be to gift someone a pillow that has to do with the Christmas season. I love these. They are from H&M. You can get one of these for about $15 to $20, but if you did a set, it would still be in the $30 price point. I think this is just really a great gift, and I think it's something that somebody would find very unexpected. I mentioned coffee table books or just books in general. In my last gift guide, you can find these books in any price point, and the majority of these books are going to be under the $25 mark. You can find a beautiful cookbook that's more of like a coffee table book. There's decor. Loving this one that I received last year. I had mentioned in the last gift guide, if you want to see me do a coffee table book gift guide, I would be happy to do that. I do have a blog post on my website currently that I put out last year for the holidays that was a coffee table book gift guide. I will have that linked in the blog post so you can check that one out. Love this recent one. I just picked this up for my daughter who just recently moved to New York, worn in New York. I thought this was super fun. If you have a loved one that loves to do their devotions, I also think getting a new devotional would make a lovely gift. A lot of these are done for a year at a time. So they could start with their new devotional January 1st. If you watched my all things bras and camis and all things panties and shapewear video, you will recognize this divider right here. I will link those videos, no worries. This is great if you have somebody who likes their organization, who likes to keep their things nice and tidy, they are going to appreciate this gift. You get four of these. In this set right here, this is how it is going to come packaged. It is $15 and some change, very affordable. All you do is open them up and you zip them closed. Neutral color, fits in your drawers perfectly. It will keep all of your undergarments super organized. 
Love it. My husband picked himself up one just because he was so jealous of mine and he is loving it as well. He always tells me it's just such a lifesaver and game changer. Picked up one of these as a gift. This would make a great kind of a surprise gift as well. Something that somebody wouldn't expect and they may not get super excited when they open it. But once they start using it, they are going to end up saying this is the best gift. Another great gift that you can't go wrong with, great stocking stuffer, is some black socks. I love these ones from H&M. I like how they're packaged with the ribbon and bow around them. These were only $9.99 and you get several pair, what, five pair. What I like about these is they are still your basic black sock. But I love how on the very top, which you won't see, but it just makes them kind of fun and festive is a little color and they're a little bit glittery. So these are awesome. Slipper socks are always a perfect gift. I know I enjoy getting slipper socks every single year. They only last me about a year because I put them through the ringer. So I think they also make a lovely gift. They are also perfect to put in a stocking. This is a two pack. Again, I like the red. I like how they put the ribbon around it. $12.99 from H&M. I will have them linked. We talked about card cases in our last couple videos because you can get them from luxury to middle of the road and you can also get them personalized, but you can also pick up little card cases like this right at your local Target. They're very cheap and I think they're awesome because we don't always need our full wallet. I know for myself, if I'm just carrying a clutch, like this clutch right here, I don't want a bulky wallet. Even though my wallet is relatively flat, you know I shared that in the first gift guide, but if I am carrying a flat clutch like this one here, I want something small. So I just put the bare necessities inside my card case tuck it inside the clutch. Since we are talking handbags, and I talked about this last year, I love the Clippa. The Clippa is a little handbag hanger. Now this is going to be different than a lot of your handbag hangers because the Clippa will fit on anything. Number one, it doesn't have to have a lip on the table. So I literally can hang this even on my dresser and have my handbag hanging and there's barely a lip. This will fit on any table. A lot of bars that you go to, if you sit up at the bar to have a couple cocktails, some of them have the hooks underneath, but some of them don't. This will fit any depth that you are dealing with. My husband picked this up for me a couple years ago. He randomly found it. It's been a game changer. I always carry one in my handbag. I have a silver one if I'm doing silver hardware, and I have a gold one, but it is always in my handbag organizer. Don't forget to watch my handbag organizer video, and you will see the clip up. Speaking of organizers, I also think a little traveling jewelry pouch or traveling jewelry box makes a really nice gift. I was gifted this one last year by my daughter. This is perfect for travel because it has different zipper compartments. It has places to put your earrings. The little snaps come off so you can put things behind there. If you have a traveler, even if they're just doing weekends away, I think a little pouch like this makes a lovely gift. This still would be a great hostess gift, secret Santa. You could still stuck it in a stocking, very affordable. Speaking of jewelry, you can also get decent jewelry sometimes in this price range. You can always go to Forever 21. This one here is actually by Topshop, and this is from Nordstrom, and it was only $15. A lot of ladies and girls love the layering necklaces. I love this one. It's very everyday. I don't think anybody is not going to like it because your simple person is going to like it. And even if somebody vamps up their jewelry a little bit more, they're still going to love something like this. And it's only $15. This would make a great gift. If your son has a girlfriend, this would be a wonderful gift. If you have a girlfriend, this would make a wonderful gift and it's not breaking the budget. I also talked in the last gift guide about getting sports team wear for your loved ones. If somebody is into a certain college team or a pro team and they like to wear stuff like that, I think that's a wonderful gift. This is a t-shirt right here. I don't want to unfold it because it's all ironed and ready to go, but this is wonderful. I also talked in the last ladies gift guide about giving chocolates, candy, specialty food. Those all make wonderful gifts. A beautifully packaged box of chocolates I think makes a super gift and you can get them in different price points. I also think a bottle of wine makes a lovely gift and that definitely falls in this price point as well. I always say you never want to spend under eight, nine dollars for a bottle of wine and it can go up from there. This one here is La Crema. 
it's a Chardonnay. This is an excellent Chardonnay. I would totally recommend this. You could probably get this for about the $14, $15 price range, especially if you found a good sale on it. But you can also go a lower price point. These are sangria. These are so festive. I think this just makes such a lovely gift. And again, you can pair a box of chocolates with it and it makes a wonderful gift. This is a great hostess gift. This is a great girlfriend gift. I would enjoy this gift. I don't really think that you can go wrong. I also am pretty fluent in wine, so that is another gift guide that I could do as well as I could make wine recommendations for you to give in different price points for your loved ones or as hostess gifts. A lot of it is knowing the recipient and if they are a wine drinker. If somebody is definitely a wine drinker, you are going to make a different selection than somebody that you don't know if they are or not and you're just getting them a bottle of wine by chance. I would have different recommendations for different people. So if you wanted me to do a gift guide sharing what some of my favorite wines that I would pick up as gifts, let me know in the comment section below. We could definitely do that. Another little option you would have to do to be fun and kind of festive and, and something people wouldn't think about, the unexpected, is do a bottle of wine and do some little cocktail napkins. These ones here say, please do not drink and fly. I love that. There's all sorts of cute themed ones that say different things. That would make a really fun and catchy gift. This would also be a wonderful secret Santa gift or a stocking stuff or something like that. If you are in a secret Santa exchange and you're giving something several days a week or over the whole period of the month, again, it all adds up. You got to think outside the box. What is something that's unique that nobody would think of? I think some fun cocktail napkins with a cute little clever saying on it would make a great secret Santa gift. We talked about the monthly subscription boxes in the last two videos. If you do a one-time monthly subscription box, it may get you over the $25 mark but some of them might fall below, so I will make sure I put a list of the different varieties that are out there. This one here is Birchbox. They always come in the cutest packaging. I'm sure there's something out there for everyone, and I will have lots of options linked for you. There you have it. This concludes the Ladies Gift Guide series. We have the men done, we have the women done, and now we get to go out and blow all of our money, because <laughs> that's pretty much what happens. But I thank you so much for joining me along this journey of the Christmas season. We are past Thanksgiving now. Now we are fully into the spirit of Christmas and never forget to stay positive, stay happy, never lose sight of what we are celebrating, never lose sight of giving and loving. All right, thanks again for joining me. I will see you soon in the next video. Take care.